Hi guys, so as it says in the title of this video, this video is about what guys should know about girls. So how I thought of this video was, today in class I was talking to one of my really good friends and she was just moaning to me about her ex-boyfriend and about how boys don't understand and it just really got me thinking and I just thought why not make a video about it because certainly not every girl but definitely girls that I know would agree to this and I feel as if boys should know this because it will help them out as well as helping us out a lot so I hope you guys enjoy this video so if you've upset us or made us super angry then we have two levels of anger now the first stage is okay and this is when we start arguing back and that's when you know we're angry but then the second stage that's silence and geez, like that is the worst thing you can get from a girl. If we're ignoring you and you don't hear anything from us, like trust me, be scared because that is when we are so, so angry. And keep on texting us because if you ignore as well, there's gonna be no conversation. So that's just where it all goes wrong. So seriously, don't ignore us back because us ignoring you is bad enough already. So don't even ignore us back because I'm telling you now, that is the worst thing. Now us girls, sometimes we say things that aren't actually for the meaning, we just say them for a different reason, like all girls would get this, but boys most likely wouldn't get this. And for example, this actually happened to one of my friends. She was on a date with her boyfriend. She goes, oh, I'm so cold. And he was like, yeah, same. Zipped up his jacket. No, you don't do that. Like, that's just plain rude. You don't zip up your jacket. Like, no girl is saying they're cold so you can zip up their jacket. You don't do that. Oh, it's so frustrating. Just, please don't do that. What she means by that is, she either wants a cuddle or she wants to wear your jumper. Or, I mean, be a man and let her wear your jacket for like half an hour. I mean, be cold for the girl that you like. I mean, seriously, it's not that hard. So this next one, this goes both ways, but I know every single girl that I know hates this. Like, more than anything in the world. This is the worst thing. I know that I hate it. Every one of my friends hate it. Boys hate it as well. But as this is a video about what guys should know about girls, then I know that every single girl hates this. And this is slow replies. So if we're texting, you know, having our normal conversation, and suddenly you don't reply, and you reply four hours later, like it was two minutes ago. No, if I wanted to talk to you four hours later, I could have gone to your house, delivered you a letter, you could have then delivered me one back in that four hours amount of time. But no, you know, you text me four hours later. It's so annoying. Okay, so then we question you, and you know, you have to make it even worse and go, oh, I was in the shower. What, for four hours? You know, I saw your Snapchat, your tweet, your Instagram photo, your online on Facebook. I mean, come on. No fuck you lying. Why? Why you always lying? Why? Oh my god. Stop fucking lying. Seriously? So us girls, we overthink a lot. Now, every girl I know would agree to this. They overthink. I overthink. Every girl overthinks. I'll be surprised if they don't. This could be like, so if you send us a text and you send in three kisses and then next minute you send two kisses and we're like, well, what, the, what have we done? Like, we've done something wrong. Like, we just overthink that's what we're like. Or if you've read it and then you haven't replied for like five minutes, we're like, oh my God, we've so done something wrong. That's just what girls are like. So don't take it personally because honestly, that's just what we're like. We have loads for emotions and we just overthink a lot. And you should be flattered that we care that much. So most girls are a sucker for guys that smell nice and this definitely works both ways but if you smell nice it would genuinely just make you a more of an attractive person because who wants someone that smells a B.O.? Like seriously? No one. So always make sure you smell nice. That's a really really big tip. Okay, so make an effort. If you like a girl, prove it to her. I mean, we all like, you know, having movie nights and cuddling, but go out now and again. Take her out somewhere, like take her bowling or to the cinema or something to eat. I mean, it doesn't even have to cost anything. Like, even if you said, oh, we're gonna go for a walk around the park, like, that's better than just staying in all the time because it's like you're doing something and you're doing it for her and for you together. No girl has, well, that I know has ever ended a relationship because she's been like, oh yeah, he takes me out way too much. 
no. So seriously, take her out and do something. <laughs> Never, ever, 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 ever say to a girl, somebody's on their period, or, oh yeah, is it because you're on your period? No, like, if we was on our period anyway, we're not going to admit it to you, so it's a losing battle, there's no win-win out of that situation. Like, you don't gain anything from it. All it does is make us mad, and therefore, you would be scared, because when we're mad, it's not good. Okay, so the little things. Now, these are things that most of the time, you probably don't even notice. So if we get a new lipstick, or we've changed our nail colour, and you notice it, it's going to make us feel so special because it's not something that most people would notice about us that much. Like, obviously girls do because that's like a girly thing. But the fact that you took time to notice it about us, it makes us feel so much happier. So it's the little things that really mean much. Compliments. Now nobody can get enough compliments. Who doesn't love being complimented? Obviously it's gonna make people feel good about themselves and especially if it's someone that you're like talking to or you're speaking to or you're going out with, like your boyfriend or your girlfriend, if you get a compliment from them, obviously it's gonna make you feel so special. So public show of affection. Now, if you're walking down the streets or if you're in town or wherever you are and you put your arm around your girlfriend or you hold her hand, obviously all it's gonna make her feel is that you're proud to have her and it's gonna make her feel so lucky and happy, of course. So that's one thing that I would say definitely means a lot to every single girl. And if you like someone, I mean, that's something you should want to do anyway. Snapchat. That girl you're speaking to, or your girlfriend, she better be your best friend on Snapchat. Because if not, why not? She's going to find out, she's going to know who it is and why. So you better get your explanations ready. So I hope you guys have enjoyed the video. It was a bit different and obviously it doesn't go to every boy or every girl, but it relates to a lot of boys and girls that I know myself. And so I thought it would be a really funny video to film and seriously, I've made myself laugh quite a lot whilst filming this. So yeah, it was fun to film and I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. If you agreed to anything that I said today on this video, let me know in the comments below. And girls, if you have any more tips for boys, or boys, if you have tips for us girls, then let us know in the comments below because I sure know it would be fun to read through all of your comments. And I will see you very soon with another video. Bye! Who it is? Tell them why. Oh, cry. Okay. <laughs> Bye. There's it. It's gone, but then obviously she's gone to find out. <laughs> it's gone. So her heart's like going, and her heart's like gone, so it's gone now. Woo! Okay. <laughs>